This is Rob Tubber for Boxing Social in association with Betfred. Delighted to be joined by the new English champion, Liam Davies, after a spectacular performance against Sean Cairns here at Wembley. Liam, first and foremost, congratulations. What did you make of your performance? Thank you. Uh, I think I performed good. I performed under pressure and uh, I won the belt and that was that was the target. I didn't, didn't care how I won it, I just wanted to win it and I think I won it in style like I said I would tonight. So I backed up what I've been saying all week and I'm satisfied with my performance tonight. You came out of the blocks in the first round very quickly, you got the jab going, you really established your range nice and quick. Were you surprised by anything in the opening round? Uh, not really, he was, he was awkward to be honest. He was a bit slippery and tricky but I just knew I was, I was landing hard shots. When I was landing, I was landing hard and clean. So I knew in the end it was going to. If he wasn't going to over, I knew it was taking it out of him, and um, that's why I kept to it. Really, I didn't go too mad of it, but I kept stumping him here, there, and everywhere. And I can hear him wincing and holding me. So I knew in the end, if I wasn't going to stop him, I was going to slow him down, and he wasn't going to keep up because. I was going to keep going and going until the final bell stopped me. It seemed to me like what you were doing was very simple but very, very effective. Was there more to your game that we didn't see tonight that you're looking forward to showing us next time? Yeah, 100%. Like I say, they rang me two weeks ago for this fight. I was ticking over, but I didn't have a full training camp for it. So that's why I was pacing myself where next time you'll see more explosive Liam Davis, 100%. Now, Eddie Hearn was sat next to me. There was plenty of noises coming from him. It looked like he liked what he saw. How important is it for you to be putting on that type of performance now when opportunities are really limited? Yeah, 100%. Well, this is the big time for me. Well, for any boxer, this is the big time and this is where I want to be on. I believe I'm good enough to be on and I hope I prove myself tonight and uh, I'll be back and prove myself time and time again because um, I believe I'm one of the best bantamweights and the hardest hitting bantamweights in the division. So can't wait to come and prove myself again. What type of message do you think this sends out to the rest of the bantamweights in the, in the UK? That there's a new name, new name in the bantamweight division and I'll fight anyone, honestly, I'll fight anyone. I just want belts, I want to get myself out there and I want to keep proving myself that I'm good enough to mix it with the best in the division. When can we expect to see you back in the ring? I'm, I'm sure you're chomping at the bit to get back in there. Yeah. As soon as I get a phone call, I'll be back, trust me. <laughs> I ain't, I'm going to tick over over Christmas and whenever they need me, just phone me because I'll be here. Maybe enjoy a nice wing stop beforehand. Yeah, that 100%. <laughs> Maybe a few. And a McDonald's on the way home. I'm my dad. <laughs> Liam Davis, the new English bantamweight champion. Congratulations. Very impressive performance. Thanks very much for speaking to Boxing Social. Look forward to catching up with you soon. Thank you very much. And cheers for all the time this week you spent. And uh, I look forward to talking to you again with another belt, a new belt, hopefully next time. Thank you very much. Look forward to it, Liam. Congratulations. Cheers.